Well, preseason's gone very well for a number of reasons. Um, we've got a lot of good work done, some progress built on some things from the spring uh, and last fall. Uh, integrated the freshmen well, I think, but we're also uh, going into Friday's game uh, with no injuries. We've got a full complement of available players. I could not be more excited to be back and, you know, hopefully end on a high note here at Lafayette. We're all excited to be back and ready to work hard, and I think that we have a lot of potential and we can't wait to see what our team can do this season. I'm really excited because we have a lot of young talent and we have leaders all over the team in every single class. The freshmen have acclimated really, really well. We make it really a big part of our job is to really include them and to make them feel as comfortable as possible because, you know, you want to get the best out of them. And if they're comfortable, then they'll probably play their best. But for the most part, they're doing pretty well. It's the one thing right now I cannot give the freshmen is the experience of the juniors and seniors. They have to obviously uh, take time together. But we also didn't ultimately reach our goal last season either. So there's plenty of us to uh, look forward to and plenty of things that we're we're looking to attain this year that we didn't last year. I know last year we had a strong mentality. We worked really hard, and I think that we just want to take, take what we worked on um, last season and bring it into this fall. Last year was big for us. Although we didn't make it to the playoffs, I think we used our record as sort of the foundation for the season. We're really looking forward to build off of that because we think that we have so much promise in this team this year where we just see a lot of the returners just growing as players. And we couldn't be more excited just to you know, include the freshmen who are also all very good and all have special qualities about them. Our seniors last year had really great leadership and set us in the right direction for this year and kind of gave us a plan on what we we're gonna do to change our culture. I definitely think that this season will be better than last season. We mainly play our non-conference schedule Friday, Sunday. Uh, our conference games are not Friday, Sunday. So that's a benefit for the players' freshness. But of course, opening weekend, playing uh, two soccer games within 36 hours of each other. Uh, we just do single sessions in preseason again for you know, purposes of keeping players injury free, keeping them fresh, and then we go into Friday, Sunday, which is kind of the exact opposite philosophy of what we've been training. You know, it's, it's gonna be a lot, but it's gonna be really nice to be able to play against an opponent that's not, you know, your own team. And, you know, we have some really good opponents with uh, Sienna, who won the MAC last year. I think it's a really big challenge for us to have all these, these five games before we even start school. I think, though, it will really pay off in the long run because we're gonna be ready for a season. We're gonna have experience. Everyone's gonna be ready to play.